Hello LHS, I'm Dan. I'm Jess. And welcome back to the Advisory Report. Today is November 27th and it is National Day of Giving. Today's schedule is C, D, E, F, G. Before we begin today's announcements, teachers will lead in a salute to the flag and review the core values of LHS. Hey, do you know what the core values of LHS are? Uh, I don't know. The core values of Lincoln High School are... Respect. Integrity. Safety. Engagement. Unity. Five. Rise up everyone and off this morning's announcements. Diversity Week started yesterday. Today's activity is called Step Over the Line If your advisory teachers will have the information you need to conduct this activity. Seniors, it is time to join the 2019 Yearbook Google Classroom. When you join Classroom, you will be able to access the senior and faculty superlative voting forms as well as senior quote information. The classroom code is O-A-R-Q-B-F. See Ms. Kalinda for any questions. Jenny Arcofano is holding a blanket drive this week. Make sure you bring in new or gently used blankets to school. The advisory with the most donations wins a free breakfast. See you, Jenna, with any questions. Have a great day and always remember to be a good person. It's not that hard. Stay, Stay classy, classy LHS. LHS. This week at LA Judge is going to be a diversity week. It'll be a week dedicated to learning about what makes us different and celebrating those differences. To honor Diversity Week, we decided to go around LHS asking people what makes them unique and special. Hey Dan, what's up Adam? What do you think makes you really unique? What makes me unique? Why unique? What do you mean? Oh gosh. That's a tough question. That's a pretty tough question. Can I think about it for two seconds? Yeah. Can you answer this question really quick? Can't wait. What makes me unique? Everything. <laughs> it certainly wasn't an easy question. However, once they had time to think, students and teachers at LHS realized just what made them unique. I know I'm not very special, Zach. Come on, we're special. Yeah, but anyway, what to make you special is how you try to help everyone. So what's, what's unique about me? Um, I love to bake, and then I love sports. So I feel like we have a good, um, I think I have a good well-roundedness about my own self. Maybe as being a Yankee fan and a sea of Red Sox fans, that might make me unique. And still a Buffalo Bills fan, that makes me unique, right? I think what makes me unique is I like to get involved in all school activities by participating in clubs and sports and other school events. Part of, I think, what makes me um, me is um, having grown up um, as, an, as not only a daughter of an immigrant family, but being an immigrant myself and being really uh, closely in touch with that experience. So what makes Zach unique? He drives a boat while from 1980, right? Nine, five, 19, 1999? 1989. Um, also, I donated a kidney. Uh, and I was like a living donor for um, somebody. So I gave them extra time in life. He drives like these big old cars, which is really cool. Zach's really interested in like old things. Like he loves jazz, like swing jazz, Frank Sinatra. It's not very mainstream, but um, but it's pretty cool. Yeah, I'm a good swimmer too, I guess. I still swim, so that makes me unique for an older guy, right? What makes me unique is that I have dual citizenship. I have American citizenship and a Dutch citizenship. What makes me unique is that I was born in California. A lot of, a lot of kids come in and they might not know that I've coached boys volleyball before. I played college volleyball. Um, I am 100% Portuguese. I was born and raised in Europe, in, the, in Portugal, in the Azores. Uh, so my first language is Portuguese. So I have uh, 
a different cultural background than a lot of people here in the United States. And what I respect about Jason, he's trying to um, tutor me for um, the SATs. I've got confidence in that I can actually pass and hopefully get a better grade. And he's always been a great friend and always been there for me whenever I needed him. I came to the United States when I was 16 and it was certainly a unique experience. I came to from a different country, I didn't speak the language. I went to Shea High School where I did not speak the language, didn't have any friends, but I was able to adapt through a lot of hard work. So what makes us unique is that we are both members of the cross country team and there's not a lot of us, are there? Yeah, and we're both like, well, like for the cross country team's like a family, so yeah, it makes us good people and like, <laughs> I don't know. I was born in Russia and moved here when I was nine. That's what makes me unique. My sense of humor makes me unique. My enthusiasm makes me unique. And I think that definitely having that different experience definitely makes me a little different. I see more diversity happening in, in Lincoln at the high school and it somehow it feels more like home. This week is all about celebrating what makes us all diverse and different. All, and our differences are what makes us all special. Rise up LHS.